Hey everybody, I'm Paul Forty for Acida Pop Real Reviews, and on today's show we're going to review the movie Amour. It was written and directed by an Austrian gentleman named Michael Haneke or Haneke or Haneke. I uh, don't really know how to speak Austrian, so I don't know how to pronounce his name. But either way, um, this movie was nominated and won the Oscar nomination for Best Foreign Picture of the Year. It's still out there in theaters. Uh, you might have to look a little bit to go find it, but it's out there in the art houses, and I suggest you get out and see it. Matty, why don't you tell us a little bit more about Amour? Thank you, Mr. Forty. Amour. Now, this is a movie that I really didn't have too much expectations going in to see. I watched the film. It's a French movie. I'm not a huge fan of the French, the frogs, you know. They never really helped us in World War II or anything. Still a little miffed about that. But the movie was good. Uh, I, I honestly loved it. The story was, was very good. It's about a loving couple, upper class couple, in their high 80s, one of them develops a stroke and pretty much it's all downhill. Doesn't want to go to a hospital so her husband takes care of her at home. It's very sad, it's very real, it's, uh, it's, it's depressing, but what a, what a touching love story. I will say one thing of this movie, Emmanuel Riva, who was up for Best Actress, she broke a record, I think oldest woman ever nominated for an, for an Oscar. And I think she also was oldest woman ever topless in a movie. And I'm not gonna lie to you, she wasn't that bad. They, they were pretty nice breasts for an 86 year old lady. Um, I honestly thought the movie was great. I do wanna say one more thing about Emmanuel Riva. She was a bombshell knockout when she was younger. Holy smokes. I couldn't believe how good looking this lady was. I was like, that, that old bat was in this movie, Amor? Oh, good for her. I, I Props to Emmanuel Riva for being good looking when she was younger. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> but anyways, I did love the movie. It's very sad. The ending is uh, a little tough. Uh, go see it. You're going to love it. You'll be probably a little depressed, but I think you'll like it. Thank you very much. Have a nice day, everyone. Thank you very much, Maddie. Uh, Maddie liked it, I liked it, I recommend you go see it. Find it in a theater near you and get out and see a more. Until next time, I'm Paul Forty. That was Maddie W. Kelly for a Cedar Pot Real Reviews. Be sure to check out Maddie's movie reviews on the Norwood Patch. You can check them out online at norwood.patch.com.